Hi dear students, in this video I will show you how to manage your account on WeTeach. First I will show you how to join a course. There are many ways to find a course. The first is through the home page, scroll down to the find your course section. In this section you can search for courses through a keyword, educational system, or subject. In keyword you can write physics for example. Also if you would like, you can choose the educational system. Then click on the find course button, and you will get directed to the results of your search. Scroll down and you will see the courses that matches your needs. As you can see there are two physics courses. In case there was many courses and you need to filter to a specific course you can scroll upwards and open advanced search. From it you can open and choose from the drop down menu of system. Level And subject. Then search and results will show below. In each course card you can see details as well as teacher name below. If you want to find out more details about the teacher click on his or her name. Then the teacher information will open, where you can see teacher's name, teaching experience, rating, also the brief experience of that teacher. Also if you scroll down a bit you will be able to see pervious students feedbacks as well as all courses taught by this teacher. So let's say I want to join this physics course then I'm going to click on join course. As join course page open you will be able to see all course details, course title, course description, the timings of the course as you can see it's Monday, 8 p.m. and Friday, 3 p.m. Please note that all of these timings are according to Cairo's local time. Also you can see the pricing options, all in Egyptian pounds, note that for courses, some have only per class option, some have only per course option, and fewer have both options. To join the course, you will have to click on join. Then a message will pop up to confirm that you want to join this course, you need to select option, per course or, per class, and then click join. And now congratulations you have joined the course, and it will appear in your, my subjects tab. This section of tutorial was on how to search for a course as well as joining courses. Now the next part of this tutorial will be on how to join a class. Now after you log into your account, go to, my subject. Then select the course. Now as you can see, for each course you will be able to see the class day, class timings, and the launch button of the class. If you are paying per course, then in your first time to join a class the system will deduce half of the amount from your wallet, and second half will be deduced after specific period announced by the admins, before starting the course. And you can always check your wallet balance through my wallet tab. You or your parent can always do wallet top up at any time. Just always make sure you have enough balance in your wallet. So now back to the class group. To join the class, please open the website 10 minutes ahead of the class time and click on the launch button of your class. As you can see, since I'm per class student, the system says that 248 pounds will be deducted from my wallet to attend. You will have to click yes and immediately the class will launch with you through your laptop. Don't worry if you got disconnected during class due any reason because you will be able to join again without paying once again. Just last thing, make sure you to connect to audio and to allow the website to access your mic to be able to hear the teacher. This section of tutorial was on how to join a class, next section I'll help on how to top up your wallet balance. So to top up your wallet, click top up, then enter the amount you want to add to your wallet. Then click on proceed and you will have two options to pay through, for now select Stripe. Please note that you are not paying any extra charges, because we have already reduced the class price, which means in total you are paying same amount or even a bit lesser. Click pay with Stripe and you will get directed to the checkout page. After it loads, it will show your email address, and you will be asked to enter your card details, which are totally protected and secured by Stripe. If you want to have a faster checkout next time, click on save my info. Else directly click on pay and Stripe will process your payment. Don't worry your bank should charge you in your local currency. After your payment was processed, you will be returned back to the website. As you can see on top right it says the wallet top up was successful. In case it didn't show up just refresh the webpage, and here's the credit showing up in the wallet. 